we were all just talking about how quickly the holidays happen this year. We're not ready for it. Apparently, we just got 40 days until Christmas. Holiday overspending often cited as one of the biggest reasons people struggle financially in the new year. So even though uh, we're a few weeks away now from Black Friday, a few days even, uh, your holiday planning should start now, says our financial expert Andy Manningly here in studio now with advice to help us stay financially savvy even during the holiday season. So what are the most important financial moves we can make during the holidays? Well, the first thing is to kind of start with an overall budget and decide how much money you're going to spend between savings and credit. So th that's a good place to say, how much do I really want to spend before you go out and do any shopping? Okay, so boil it down. What should we include in the holiday shopping budget? Well, it's really important to include everyone that you're going to buy for. I mean, we're pretty good about remembering friends and family, but we forget about gifts for the office, gifts for service professionals, you know, just other types of gifts like that. So we kind of forget about those. So it's really important to include that in the budget. Let's be honest. We all say, okay, it's X amount. That's my limit, right? But we usually go above that. What can we do to make that budget more realistic? Well, the big thing is you have put an amount in for each person that you want to spend and then go online and start looking for ideas to make sure you can find those places because that'll really help you avoid those impulse buys. All right, so what advice do you have for those who, who can't control the impulse buying habit? Well, before you go out and start shopping, start thinking about all the things that you'll have to give up if you overspend in the next year and write those down. And then when you go out, if you're going to overspend, cross something off the list to say, well, that's gone. At least you're making a conscious effort and you can handle that overspending when the new year starts. And don't shop for yourself. Uh, Andy, is there anything that we often overlook during the holidays that can usually make a pretty big impact? Yeah, it's all the decorations and food and things like that that we don't put into yeah. our budget. You know, yeah. it's really hard to walk by that 10-foot inflatable snowman <laughs> that has just has to be in the front of the house. So you kind of have to watch those things. <laughs> a 10-foot inflatable <laughs> snowman. Wow. I don't I want that. that. Or like the Costco bear. <laughs> I'm with yeah, you. Exactly. I know exactly it's what you're talking taller about. than my house. <laughs> all right, Andy. Thanks so much. That's great.